Lightning. This is Jeep too as well. Shelby. Roush. Cobra. 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 Cobras. Over to Celine. And a Celine. Oof. Cobras, 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 Cobras. What the fuck? GTO. <laughs> Audi. What the heck? <laughs> that shit was dope. Cars out here today. This is so funny. Hey, look at this a Nissan floating. Nissan side floating. All right, guys. So welcome back to the vlog. We're actually gonna be doing a little something to the car today. Um, as you guys seen previously in the first clips, we were at a Carson Coffee in Bakersfield. But after that, we're actually going to be starting off on the car right now. We're going to do a full BMR suspension package. Hopefully this looks good. I'm using the new tripod. So hopefully it's angled properly, looking at me properly and all that good stuff. But we have the whole BMR package right over here. Definitely, that way you guys can see everything. We have everything laid out. We're trying to be professional this time. But we have everything that we possibly need. This is from Lethal Performance. Shout out to them. They gave me a really good price on Thanksgiving or Black Friday, I mean. So we got 15% off of everything. Everything's cool. We, we, we went with all the red instead of the, the I think the Hammerstone gray. So yeah, this is definitely gonna be a little challenge for us. We're gonna be doing it all in one day. A lot of people say that this requires to drop the, the whole rear end. We're gonna see what we need to do. But yeah guys, catch you guys in a bit. <sighs> oh, too dark. Raise the bottom, raise the bottom. All right guys, so we did get one part in already. One side, got the bushings right there too as well. With the metal retainer right there. This was pretty simple. What? That was already like what? 15 minutes? Mm -hmm. 10 minutes? Mm -hmm. We still have a lot of process to go, but we'll see what happens. Alright, okay, guys. So I actually thought I was recording the whole time, and I actually did this whole side with a little help of Lucio. So I actually want to see what I can do in the bottom of the car. With he keeps drilling while I'm talking, but uh, we just lost a bunch of footage of me working on the car. As you get to see whether it's this retainer clip again, oh, we did everything that we did on the other side, or everything that Lucio did on the other side, I did on this side. And we got this over here, he just cleaned everything up. But yeah, we're doing some pretty good progress. Fast. Up next, I think we're gonna do the tow links. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we'll catch you guys in a bit. You guys can see my half shots right here, the Ford Performance ones. Big need for a car like this in the rear. Alright okay, guys, so this is actually a little bit of a pain to line up, but we finally got it in there. Um, this one, there's not much re really recording just because it's really simple, but just the hard part is lining it up. Let's take off those two bolts, and after that, try to squeeze it in, get a rubber mallet. We actually didn't have one, so we just covered a towel on a, an actual regular hammer, and got it to align properly. Took us a few tries, but we got it done. I'm going to start doing it on the other side. Um, so basically what's going on is I'm do he's doing the left side, I'm doing the right side just so I can le learn a little bit more about the suspension. Um, but yeah, we'll catch you guys in a bit, see if I record it with the POV. You can take that one off with the drill. I think so. I know so. Here. Thanks, Dad. Those are the ones I hit the most. There you go, guys. Uh, yeah, you want me to do the other part? Sure thing. <laughs> I ain't gonna deal with that. <laughs> Alright, guys, so welcome day two of the installation. Um, last night got a little too dark, too cold to as well to work on the car. So we're actually gonna start off right now. We should be done within an hour, um, 30 minutes to an hour. Depending on how fast we can cut the other bolt. Um, but yeah, since we have the half shafts in the rear, the upgraded half shafts, they're a little too big for the bolts to come out. So the brace, whatever, sort of that surrounds it. Um, so that's stopping us from able to take out the bolts. So we need to cut that one in half. The good thing is, BMR 
BMR's bolts are shorter, so they just slide right in. So we don't have to have that problem with trying to maneuver it in without dropping the whole thing or removing the axles. So it should be pretty quick. We're gonna start off. We're gonna start off on it right now. We already have the saw ready. Just gonna change out the blade, make sure everything's all good. Uh, but we'll catch you guys in a bit as soon as we start working on the car. All right, guys. So we're actually finishing up already. We have everything installed. Everything's lined up properly. We did have some issues with the differential bushings, but we got that fixed. The whole left, the whole passenger side was actually really out of alignment, so we had to line up everything for the bolts to go in properly, for the for the lockouts to sit properly too as well. But everything's back together. Uh, we're just finishing up, tying up, make sure everything's nice and tight. Uh, but everything should be done. We have the exhaust right here. We're just gonna put that back, and then we're gonna go and put the wheels back on, and we're gonna take off for a little spin, see how it drives. And then after that, we need to schedule an appointment for an alignment just to be sure everything's properly, properly set. Difference at the low speeds, but I bet you we're gonna feel it once we're like actually launching. Which we're not gonna do today. Guys, so I'm pumped for the inspection of driving the vehicle. The car actually feels a lot stiffer, which is really cool. Uh, we drove it on the freeway, it felt a lot stiffer. There was no like body movement. We took some like hard passes real quick. Um, the car felt great. We went around some turns pretty fast too as well. There was less body roll, it felt a lot stiffer. Even going down my driveway because of the little railing right there, I always feel a little thud each time I go over it. I did not feel that thud anymore. Um, so it feels a tons, tons, a tons, tons better if I can stop stuttering. Um, the real test is going to be when we take out to a drag ship. I am going to buy some skinnies next for the car so that way we can launch a lot harder. See how the car performs a lot better than doing the 10.6. I believe we're the 10.7. Uh, next time we're going to launch the car, we're going to see how close we can get to the 9s if we can even break the 9s. So we'll see what can happen. Um, again, guys, thank you guys for watching the video. Um, leave a like, comment, subscribe. The crazy amount of support you guys have been giving me for the past few weeks has been crazy. I've been getting subscribers daily. I get the notifications on my Google, Gmail, and everything. I always like check my phone. It's always like a few subscribers here and there, which is pretty cool. So thank you guys for the support. Hope you guys stick around for the next video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.